There's no fingerprints. Not on the body, not on the car. Interesting. What the hell is that on the door handle? Glue. Stay tech epoxy. I used it to fix our metal shelving. I got a little detective on my hands. See, I told you I could help. No, no. What are you doing? I can't see the picture. You can't see, that's right. Why not? Because it's a dead body and it's gross and not for your eyes. Fine. Just tell me what's in the picture. He's got a plastic bag over his head. His face looks like he's been poisoned. If they suffocated him, why would they also poison him? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe they were making a statement. You're pacing again. No, well, that's what I do when I'm crime solving. Cool. Keep pacing. I like it. Well, this all seems familiar to me, you know? Gluing the means of escape, the whole plastic bag over the head. Don't forget the poisoning. That's right. I remember there was this hitman back in the day, back when I was a kid. You were once a kid? Back when I was a kid. Okay. Uh, somehow his crew went down and he just, he just vanished, you know? No one ever saw this guy again. Do me a favor. Look up, um, look up the chemist. Hitman. Texas. Texas. Oh, this was a very bad man. Starting to come back to me now. He was famous. He was with the Dixie Mafia, and I remember he devised some pretty grisly ways to kill his victims, too. That's the statement. He was using the modus operandi of the chemist. He wants someone to know that he was the one who did it. Modus operandi? Yeah, it's Latin. Means a person-specific way of doing something. I know what M.O. means. How do you know what M.O. means? American detective shows. Hmm. Mm-hmm. What if they got a picture of them in there on your phone? This one? That can't be the same guy. Well, if it makes you feel any better, I never say no to a beer. <laughs> How long are you guys staying? We're leaving Friday. I'm gonna let you get here for our vacation on Groupon. Have you any idea how expensive this trip would have been if we had the full 10 days you wanted? <laughs> Especially on the holidays. Where are you guys visiting from? North Dakota. Oh, North Dakota. Yeah, since I retired every winter, we have to find some place for me to thaw out. And we, we always wanted to see this part of the world. Well, see, you fooled me, Colt, because that accent, I figured you first saw here. Well, once a southerner, always a southerner, I reckon. <laughs> hey. Oh, I, I left when I was 20. Met Cookie on a job in Fargo, and the rest, as they say, is history. history. You guys met on the job. A lot of travel in your line of work? There's not much travel required in the oil seed refinery business, I'm afraid. <laughs> oil seed refining. Yeah, North Dakota. Right. It's the nation's capital. Oh, we did it all. Canola seed, flax seed, mustard seed. Oh, up. for goodness sake, don't get him started on his seed. We'll be here all night. <laughs> you okay, son? I am. Yeah, I just, uh, I think I misjudged some things. Thank you so much for the beer. I have got to get back to work. You guys enjoy having... Oh, 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 sorry. Oh, no, no, don't sweat it, honey. Cole will fix it. I've got some epoxy glue back in the room. Okay. You travel with epoxy glue? Yeah, Staytech works great with metal. 